This week's Golden Apple winner teaches second grade at Fountain Inn Elementary School. As our Hannah Ward shows us, this veteran teacher has been brightening minds for 29 years. We're going to crumple it together and form our what? Snowball. Uh, form our snowball. It's not quite cold enough to snow in South Carolina. Two, one, throw. But in Ms. Meadows class, they are throwing snowballs to learn even in odd numbers. Whatever number they pick up. Even, yes, even, yes. Is where they go stand. Nine, yes. High five, one. Woohoo! Activities like this. One number plus one number. Got Ms. Meadows nominated. Lots of fun stuff. See what I let you do around the room. Preston Johnson has ADHD, so getting up and moving really helped him learn. He needed to maybe move around a little bit, and so I I'm always willing to whatever a student needs. If they need to stand up while they're working, if they need to move, if they need to get up and walk around, and I would do that with him. And any time we did that, he got right in, and he and he was able to work and and do what he needed to do. Ms. Meadows says that having fun in the classroom is actually a teaching philosophy. That's it. It, it sounds kind of funny, but I'm thinking of the three F's. To be firm, because they need some structure, and to be fun, and to be friendly. So to, to be friendly to the kids and make sure that I get to know them as students. Um, to be firm, because they need boundaries. And just have fun, because every day is a new day. No. Learning like this really helped Preston. There's so much pencil and paper, so whenever I have a chance to get something tactile, it makes it so much better for them. Zod, over here. Simple ways to make lessons fun. Woohoo! To have them do something that they normally wouldn't do in the classroom, like throw paper, but it's also, it can be learning too. Crumple it up, form your snowball. Valerie Meadows, teaching math with snowballs at Fountain Inn Elementary School.